Sunday everyone. I hope you're all having the most wonderful week this week. So this video, let's just talk about it for a second. So I've been kind of obsessed with Etsy. I just love the whole platform. They've got some really quirky stuff on there and I came across the Harry Potter mystery boxes. Now this is Gryffindors, but they also have Hufflepuff, Slytherin, and I have totally forgotten the name of the other house. Mental that one, I'm telling you. Also let me know in the comments if you want me to do the other three. They could be totally different, so make sure you drop me a comment down below. Also go and follow me on Instagram, which is Altoria underscore. I have been live streaming a lot recently, and I have been guest posting you guys. So if you want to come over for a chat, add my Instagram. We can totally make that happen. So I'm really excited now to open the Gryffindor box. Here we go. Oh, okay, I forgot to tell you guys how much I spent on this. So the box was £27.50, but with packaging, I spent £30.40. So quite a lot uh, of money, but it's from Hogwarts. Gonna have, gonna be pricey. Have you ever been to Harry Potter World? Let's remove Dumbledore's beard or hay. So first up, we have Patronus. What is Patronus. I don't know if this is a Harry Potter term, but we have Patronus here. Oh! Okay, well this smells quite creamy. It actually smells like a candle that I would have made when I was younger. It smells like it's come from a set, <laughs> if that makes sense. I actually was not expecting candles to be in this box. I was kind of expecting to get stationery or something like that, but I'm good with the candle. Let's pop you over here. Next up, we have Bertie Bott's Jelly Bean Scented Candle. So we have another candle in here. Um, I mean, it's, it's larger than the other one. And again, it's in a jam jar. It actually looks like a horseradish jar that you would have on a Sunday dinner. If you're not from the UK, Sunday roasts are, are everything on a Sunday. But it looks like she's reused a horseradish jug, but that's okay. I'm what for recycling and saving the planet. Oh, okay, so it smells like, does it smell like jelly bean? It kind of does. In my own opinion, it smells like, you know when you have chocolate in your mouth and you stick some dry fruit in at the same time, the taste of it smells like it, if that makes sense. So kind of like a dairy milk fruit and nut bar. Yeah, it, it totally smells like a dairy milk fruit and nut bar. It's actually quite nice. And again, size not bad. I put my horseradish tub here. There we go, Bertie Beans. Next up, ooh, okay. So we have butter beer soap. When I was at Harry Potter World, I actually went and tried the butter beer and I didn't like it. It was disgusting. The froth on top was quite nice, but the actual drink tasted like soda water and that someone had urinated in it. No, no, it, it didn't taste like that. It just looked like someone had peed in a cup. Okay, where am I going with this? Anyway, so this is the butter beer soap. Now I can tell you that it doesn't smell like someone has uh, peed in a cup. It actually smells like a soap that Body Shop sell. And I think it's the sheer butter soap, but I'm gonna leave a picture somewhere around the screen. But it smells very much like sheer butter. Yeah, sheer butter. It actually smells like an ex-boyfriend I had when I was like 12. Is that a bad thing? I, I have no idea. Anyway, it smells pretty good and it's handmade as well. I am actually liking the fact that it's handmade. It's not like gimmicky or commercial. And I totally was not expecting it to be a box like this. So yeah. Hmm. Next up, we have a Griffin Bore mirror. At least you can check to see if you've got lipstick on your teeth. Um, I don't know what I think of this. Um, it looks a little bit gimmicky, like Gryffindor. I would have liked to have had a Gryffindor 
badge or a mirror, but it is kind of cute. I mean, I am disappointed that it's not like a Gryffindor like badge. Do you know what I mean? When you're at school, you're given a badge, didn't you? I was the colour blue at my school and I used to wear it with pride. Used to love that badge. Ooh. That doesn't go, does it? But yeah, I would have I would have liked a Gryffindor badge, maybe. Next, we have another candle, but it's a Gryffindor candle, and it says you might belong in Gryffindor, where dwell the brave at heart, the daring nerve, or oh, is that darling? No, it's daring nerve and chivalry set Gryffindors apart. Is that when the hat goes on? Is that when they decide if they're Gryffindor or like Slytherin? What part of the film does that come from? Because it's like, it's in quotations. Anyway, so another candle, it's a good size. And again, it's in the uh, old Horace, Horace, uh, bleh, horse radish tub, but that's okay. Not gonna judge. Oh, this is the best smelling candle out of the, the others. So this smells like toffee apples or caramel. It's a little bit like the Yankee caramel toffee kind of uh, candle. And that's a massive compliment because I like Yankee candles. This smells so yummy. I like the colour of it as well. It kind of like matches the kind of pink thing I have going on in this video. Yeah, I like this. Do we have anything else? Oh, I do, but I've dropped it on the floor. Hang on. All right, okie doke. So next we have, it looks like a bookmark. Now, if you don't read, it's kind of pointless, but I must admire it because it has, let me show you, hang on. Oh, get it out the sort of thing. Nine and three quarters. That's the platform where they go through the wall and they go to the Hogwarts train. So, very Harry Potter. It is, I can't like, look. Why can I never speak in videos? It's getting a problem now and I'm not enjoying it. So as I was saying, I do like this. Nine and three quarters, very Harry Potter. I'm glad they brought that in there. It's just on some card. It's not, it's not like, it doesn't feel like it's got some sturdiness to it. I mean, I don't know about you, but my bookmarks can go through the, go through the works, if that makes sense. I don't even think that does make sense. Anyway, a bookmark. I sometimes talk utter rubbish, don't I? Is there anything else? So lastly, we just have this bit of paper here, which has, oh, it's got all the, like, the colors of the houses, and you also have the artist on the back by the looks of things. I do like this, quite pretty actually. If you're a hardcore Harry Potter fan, I mean, you could frame that, couldn't you? So that is everything inside the box. So £27.50. Do I think it's worth the money? I must admire the fact that it's all handmade. I do like that. Um, £27.50 is quite a lot of money. It seems a little bit novelty. But you guys, let me know in the description. Do you think that this is too much? I think it's okay, but a little bit pricey. Oh, wait! I forgot something else. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, don't go, don't go, because I found something else that I forgot to show you. Again, it has the Gryffindor thing, like, dwell the brave at heart, their darling nerve and chivalry setting Gryffindors apart. Um, I have, like, some sort of bracelet. It's just on some string, like, red string. It has a little triangle there. So this would be good as a bracelet or even an anklet if you wanted to. I can't believe I almost missed that. So yeah, we have a little bracelet as well. Okay, let's talk about the price again. £27.50. Uh, I think it's okay. Again, a little bit pricey. But let me know your comments down below. Wanna know what you think. So if you really like this video, give it a massive thumbs up and also let me know in the comments. Do you want me to do the other three? I'd happily do it and see if they are any, any different. Also, don't forget to follow me on social media and also my Instagram because, like I said at the beginning of this video, I am guest posting so many of you, so come on over. I'm actually doing a live stream tonight at 7pm if you want to come over, so I'll see you then. But as always, guys, please make sure that you link, like, and subscribe, and I'll see you next time for another Mystery Box video.